I'm Randy Talsig and I'm founder of Blue Core Leadership and I am so excited to be here with you today because we are launching a video series, a monthly video series called Leadership Lessons from the Cockpit. And this may sound like this is for pilots. And if you're a pilot, please stick with us. But this is not for pilots per se. This is for business owners, entrepreneurs, visionaries. We are going to take this video series and apply sound principles in flight and bring it to our businesses so we can run better businesses and actually have more fun because we're going to get to our destination quicker. A series of monthly videos with specific leadership lessons and then we're going to have a dialogue around that. So we're going to have a format where we're going to provide you a way to be able to weigh in, have conversation with us, have a dialogue, maybe even have a debate. I hope we have some debates because that's what leadership is all about. Leadership Lessons from the Cockpit really is a thought leadership platform. The thinking is we're going to take thought leaders, some of them will put in the cockpit, some of them will have outside the cockpit, and ask them to be part of this. And we're going to tee up and have these monthly videos but we'll also have some content in between the videos where there'll be interviews and discussions. And one of the important topics is going to be knowing roles and responsibilities. And we have that for every entity that supports safe flight, air traffic control, fixed based operators, maintenance people, grounds people, people who put fuel in your airplane, all of that. Very clear responsibilities to make sure that there's safe flight. We're going to talk about how that applies to business, the importance of the clarity of roles and responsibilities. What do we expect from each other? Will we debate it? Will we push for clarity? Clarity is so important so we can move forward and we can do what we need to do. Most people want to do a great job sometimes we don't know what's expected of us. An obvious topic in business, a very obvious topic in aviation, if we're not good communicators, uh, first pilots and air traffic controllers, some bad things can happen. So we have a, a very specific way of communicating and we have a language that is unique to aviation. I'm going to suggest that there is a unique language in your business. What's important is that we understand that language, we respond to that language, and we help each other understand what we need to be able to stay on course. Pushing for clear communication, consistent communication, it's so critical in the cockpit, it is so critical in our businesses. Another area that is very important is process. There's a process to land the airplane. Would you agree with me that that's an important process? One of the pieces of a process that's common in aviation is the checklist. Great businesses that repeat their success have their version of a checklist. They have their versions of process that help them stay on course to make sure that they do things right the first time. So what's the takeaway? Well, quite simply, it's about taking the disciplines that we have in the cockpit, bringing them to our businesses, so we can be more effectively reaching our vision. It's about recognizing that we need strong leaders to run great organizations. So we're going to tee up every month a leadership lesson from the cockpit to build conversation and debate around. And that's the other part of this. It's about community. It's about you. It's about thought leaders. I invite you to be part of this journey, to explore, to learn, to share, to uncover the disciplines embedded in great leadership. I'm officially inviting you into the cockpit. Fasten your seatbelt. We've been cleared for takeoff. Now I want you to put your hand on the throttle and apply full power. Together, we're gonna to build the momentum we need to lift off and rapidly achieve your vision. This is exciting. See you soon.